right quick uh, instruction video on using the mr 12 volt or it's also called la power i've got the standard um mercedes command uh, module here it's got the C cd single slot there which obviously i've just got a phone mount plugged in and then in the back in here i did have my cd changer but i've um i've unplugged that because behind this panel is where i've plugged in the mr 12 volt or um, la power and it just sits behind this i can put it off to get to it nice and easy so back to the display at the moment it's playing through the usb and it, as you can see it's got the name there you can go up and down through whatever music you've got stored on your usb this is my son's playlist um, the usb i've just wired it through into the center console and uh, you can see it just there there's a usb there's also an audio in as well. Now, the audio in, I've actually wired that to my DAB pure digital radio. So if I go back and press number six, it switches to now saying audio in. And the audio in is gonna play whatever I've got on my DAB. In this case, it's absolute uh, radio. You know, you can change it to whatever you want. Let's say you wanted, um, Radio 1, hit that, and then Radio 1 is now playing through the car. Crystal clear sound, it doesn't change on Radio 1 there, you have to look at it on the screen there, but it's not much of a hardship. Press the number 6 again, and this will play um, the next uh, format, which is Bluetooth audio. So I've got um, the last song that I happen to have on my phone, which fantastic Mr. Peter Gabriel, Sledgehammer. And if I press the up and down buttons with the CD screen on your dash, it will change the channel, uh, change the uh, song. Um, so now we're going to have the amazing Don't Give Up. Slow start on that. Let's try it again. I can go back, press the back button. Previous track. Hang on a second. There you go, there's Sledgehammer there. So you can go up and down through the tracks that way and you can do that with USB as well. Um, if I hit uh, USB. Going back. All right, now if I press the button here. See, it goes back there as well. Volume button obviously works as normal. And that's really about it. Um, one thing that's really annoyed me today, I've got this black smudge blodge. I used to have one up here and that's kind of just about gone. I found though by using something like a, a hard instrument, you can actually push it away. It's going to take a bit of time. It used to be right in the middle here. If anybody knows how to fix that, maybe you can use a heat gun or something. But as I said, I've got two on there now. Never used to have them up until this week. Hope that gives you a little bit of um, information on how to use the uh, Bluetooth adapter. By the way, I don't have the phone connected, um, even though it does come with a phone microphone. Underneath, I've got the standard um, microphones, which has got the Bluetooth inbuilt because I have the Bluetooth module, which comes with the car. So I use that because it comes up on the screen it actually shows me my phone signal there um, and I think the microphone is far better with the Bluetooth standard than it is with with the uh, with the kit that you get from Mr 12 volt and that's really about it I was just gonna say um, one more thing people have gone on about batteries uh, car batteries I'm talking about a little tip I've had all sorts of different batteries and by far the most reliable battery that you want for your car is the just go to mercedes and get the mercedes battery it will do as it says it really does work you don't get any low voltage um, or any issues at all it's a strong battery and they've obviously been engineered and designed because these cars are power hungry and back in the day i actually wired in a little voltmeter there so that if i start the car you can see that it's going up to 14 point one volts which is the correct charging I had to put that in because the battery I had before despite it being a brand new battery just wasn't holding the charge 
Mercedes battery has never let me down. It's been a brilliant battery. Anyway, thanks very much. Have a good Christmas.